the northern coast of Spain, especially the Asturian coast, is famous for its wild landscapes with impressive cliffs that drop straight into the Cantabrian Sea. And between them, small hidden beaches creating a mix of nature and majesty. The cliffs of Asturias stretch along its entire coastline. They are undoubtedly beautiful. Rocky formations that rise above the sea, sculpted by the actions of the wind and waves over centuries. This time we are going to enjoy the beauty of Riba de Sella, Colunga and Lastres. For me, these are among the most charming towns of the Asturian coast. This entire area itself is a visual spectacle. It offers us a contrast of landscapes where the strength of the sea meets the solidity of the land, creating an unparalleled natural environment perfect for both hiking lovers and those seeking the beaches to relax. And of course, we cannot forget the numerous cultural offerings and the delicious Asturian cuisine. The first town in our trip is Riba de Sella. It is a picturesque and charming coastal town located on the eastern coast of Asturias, famous for its combination of history, nature and culture. On the banks of the Sella River, this municipality is known for its fishing port, its beaches and its spectacular natural surroundings framed between the mountains of the Picos de Europa and the Cantabrian Sea. The Riba de Sella beach, also known as the Playa de Santa Maria, is considered one of the town's jewels and one of the most emblematic beaches in Asturias. It stretches over approximately 1.5 kilometers. This beach has beautiful fine golden sand and is bordered by a pleasant promenade lined with elegant mansions in the Indiano style. The waves of the Cantabrian Sea are moderate, making it ideal for relaxed swimming and water sports like surfing, especially in its more distant area. One other great thing about the north of Spain is its beaches, with its cold water because of the Atlantic, but uh, the beaches that we have are awesome, so you really need to come here guys and check out these awesome beaches. From the chapel of the Virgen de la Guilla, you can enjoy the beautiful natural surroundings and the incredible views of the town. This is a small Renaissance chapel from the 16th century, that houses the patron saint of sailors. In addition, a stroll through the port offers the chance to see colorful boats and enjoy local cuisine at the restaurants along the estuary, offering once again beautiful views and of course a wide variety of dishes. We had lunch on a terrace of one of them and were very pleasant with both the traditional food and its quality. Remember, it is rare in Asturias not to eat well or leave hungry. We continue our trip with the town of Colunga. It is a charming municipality located on the eastern coast of Asturias, just a few kilometers from Riva de Sella. This picturesque town stands out for its rich cultural and natural heritage, offering visitors a unique combination of golden sand beaches and lush green mountain landscapes. The beach of La Griega in Colunga is located away from the urban area, making it one of the most peaceful and least crowded beaches in the region. The old town preserves traditional Asturian architecture with cobbled streets and colorful facades. Walking through its streets we can find the clock tower, which as we know it today was built in 1751, as well as the Romanesque church of San Cristobal. 
In the busiest tourist moments in summer, the town comes alive, thanks in large part to the activities that take place. We were lucky enough to visit the small town during a medieval market and witness the great variety of the Asturian cuisine. Colunga is also very well known for its famous Jurassic Museum of Asturias, which attracts researchers and paleontology enthusiasts from all over the world with its impressive fossil exhibition. Tens of millions of years ago, dinosaurs roamed these lands and left their mark in the form of footprints. Their discovery made the coast of Colunga an international reference in this field. The Jurassic Museum of Asturias, or more commonly known as Muja, is a distinctive and very original architectural building with a structure that evokes the shape of a dinosaur footprint. The facade has a modern and dynamic appearance that contrasts with the surrounding natural landscape. The building is located on a small hill, offering impressive panoramic views of the rural environment and the coastal line. Hi guys, we are in the Museo del Jurásico de Asturias or the Jurassic uh, Asturias Museum and did you know that this museum counts with the most diverse and the most numerous footprints of dinosaurs in the entire Europe and the third in the world and behind me is a great example of a dinosaur, a sauropod and uh, you should definitely come here and visit this museum, it's in Colunga and uh, yeah, come to Spain The interior of the Mucha is designed to provide an educational and immersive experience about the era of the dinosaurs. Upon entering, you are greeted by a room housing an impressive collection of dinosaur replicas and also of authentic fossils. The exhibitions are organized chronologically, allowing a journey that begins in the Triassic period and moves through the Jurassic and Cretaceous periods. The rooms are equipped with modern interactive technologies, such as touchscreens and simulations. The museography is designed to facilitate understanding of the evolutionary processes and ancient ecosystems, while thematic sections address specific aspects, such as paleobotany and reptile evolution. Leaving Colunga and just a few kilometers away, we find the most beautiful town of the Asturian coast, Las Tres. This destination has a traditional fishing atmosphere and a rich maritime history. The old town of Las Tres is characterized by its narrow cobble streets, colorful houses and wooden balconies that seem to hang over the sea. From various points in the town you can enjoy impressive views of the coast and the Cantabrian Sea, making Las Tres an ideal place for those who appreciate natural beauty and tranquility. Nevertheless, the heart of the town is the port of Las Tres. From here we can observe the traditional fishing boats, fishing enthusiasts and the bustle of marine life. The local cuisine is another of the great attractions you can't miss. The natural surroundings of Las Tres are equally impressive, with trails and cliffs inviting you to explore the beauty of the Asturian landscape. It's also highly recommended to enjoy the nighttime views of the town. It's a beauty that is hard to describe. So these are the three Asturian coastal towns that exude the most charm and magic. 
you should choose this route if your aim is for a few days of relaxation and disconnection. If you want to enjoy the beaches, the serenity of the sea and its breeze, the local cuisine and of course the Asturian hospitality. My name is Alex Moraras, I hope you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, share and definitely subscribe to find out more amazing places to visit before you come to Spain.